Hey now! Hi everybody, Gribbon here, and finally, we now have the Ultimate Custom Night update for the PS4. So let's not waste any time and let's just jump right into this. So as we look at the tweet from Click Team, Ultimate Custom Night Patch 1.01 is released for Sony PlayStation 4 in North America territory. Please allow up to 48 hours for the update to hit your PlayStation 4. We hope the European patch follows soon after. This update includes the following. Now, we're going to go through each one of these to see if they actually hold up to this tweet. Added a controller sensitivity option and added a pause screen. So while you're in the game, hit the options button and you now have a pause menu and you can also do the controller sensitivity options as you see fit. Check. Added cheats. Before you even start around, hit the options menu and you now have access to a cheat menu. Check. Move flashlight from A cross to B circle. This threw me for a loop for the first time and I'll explain why and it revolves around Chica. So if you were using X, or cross, to reset the ventilation or choose a different camera, you can no longer use this on the kitchen camera if Chica is active. Why? Because every time you choose a different camera or reset the ventilation system, it changes the music to the music box. This automatically activates Chica. So get used to hitting circle unless you're in the main office area when Nightmare BB is active. Then you'll have to switch to cross to deal with Rockstar Freddy and his Fazbear coins or Rockstar Foxy and his parrot. Or Helpy. Yes, fixed pressing on Helpy. Check. Fixed all off button shortcut. Check. Fixed speed of adjusting AI levels. Check, and thank God for that. Fixed faz coin sometimes not appearing. Never noticed this before. Don't notice it now. Check. Fixed missing sounds, Afton and Rockstar Foxy. Yar, you win some, you lose some. Check. Fixed warnings showing on the counterintuitive side of the screen. I know some people have dealt with this, but I never saw it, and I don't see it now. Check. Removed ability to cheat challenges. Check. PS4, fixed AI levels being randomized on the menu. Check. Also, thank you God for this one. Microsoft Store now available for Windows 10 on PC. Someone please give me a legitimate reason why this exists. Open up a Steam account. It's free on Steam. This just seems like a way of tricking people out of their money. One issue I've noticed, you can't use the flashlight whenever you're in the camera section. On PC, you could do this to get rid of Fredlets or Phantom Freddy. On the PS4 version, you cannot. Now the question that we ask ourselves, is it worth it to you to buy this? My opinion doesn't change. If this is the only way that you can play this, then by all means it's a half decent port now, but PC still reigns supreme and it's free. This also doesn't sit well with me with this Microsoft Store now available still trying to charge you $7.99 for a game that's free on a platform that you can play it free on. Before the Xbox people jump on me and tell me that this is a way that they can not only play it on their Xbox but on their PC as well, let me ask you something. Why do you need mouse support, keyboard support, and PC support? When you have a keyboard and your mouse support basically hooked up to your Xbox, aren't you nearly playing it like a PC to begin with? Take a look again and tell me that this isn't at least an act of deception on Click Team's part to try to lure a couple extra dollars from someone not knowing that this game is free. Unless somebody can tell me a legitimate reason why this would be a good thing to purchase on the Microsoft Store, all this is to me is Click Team trying to capitalize on somebody's ignorance. Don't buy this from the Microsoft Store. Play it from Steam. It's free. 
I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, be sure to like and subscribe. Also, join the community. I'll leave links in the description on how you can do that. Also, if you found any bugs that I didn't mention, please mention them in the comments and we'll have a discussion about it. But until the next video or the next stream, my friends, stay happy, stay healthy, stay safe. Bye-bye.